Hello, dear students. Today we will discuss about the instruments of tonsillectomy. There are various instruments which are used in the tonsillectomy. The first instrument is Boyle's Davis mouth cap. This is Boyle's blade and this is Davis mouth cap. This assembly is used like this. This is written like that. The, <coughs> this is placed over the teeth and this blade is used to push the tongue. The, this is used for the various surgeries of the oral cavity like parietal surgery, surgeries of tonsil, adenoidectomy and surgery of angiofibroma. The sizes of the blade are different sizes available like the number 5, 4, 3, 2, 1 according to the age of the patient. The next instrument is reference bipod. These are the two reference di bipod and this is fitted in the Mavron's plate. This is Mavron's plate. This assembly is used like that. To this is like that. To suspend the world's nearest mark. This is the whole assembly used for the tonsillectomy. So these are the, this is Boyle's Davis mouth gag. These two are the reference by port and this is Magnus plate. The next instrument is used in the tonsillectomy is Dennis Brown tonsil holding corset. This is used to hold the tonsil and push medially. The difference is is here in the Dennis Brown tonsil holding forcep and the Lux forcep. The students are confused between the Dennis Brown tonsil holding forcep and Lux forcep. The differences, the two differences are main. The one is the plates of Dennis Brown tonsil holding forcep is the upper plate is smaller than the lower plate and the edges are blunt. But in Lux forcep, the both plates are of equal size and the edges are sharp. The next instrument is Mollison's tonsillar dissector and anterior pillar retractor. This blunt end is used to dissect the tonsil from the tonsillar bed and the anterior pillar retractor is used to retract the anterior pillar after the surgery to visualize any bleeding point. The next instrument is Eve's tonsillar snare. This is used to cut and crush the tonsil from the lower bone. This the tonsil is held with the, the this uh, the tonsil holding forcep is passed between this wire like this and hold the tonsil and this wire is pushed up to the lower pole. When we reach at the lower pole, uh, with this we cut and crush the tonsil from the lower pole. The action of the cutting and crushing is meant to minimize the bleeding. When we crush the uh, tonsil from the lower pole, the vessels are constricted and uh, various uh, vessel constrictions are released. This minimizes the bleeding. The next instrument is tonsillar artery forcing. These are two arteries. One is straight and one is curved to <coughs> catch the uh, to hold the arteries during the or tonsillectomy to minimize the bleeding. The next instrument is Neger's curve artery forcep to uh, hold the vessel and to tie the knot. This is the <coughs> curved scissor to does, uh, cut or dissect the tonsillar tissue. These are the two bow forcep. One is tooth forcep and that is non tooth forcep. These are used to hold the bars piece and to mop the tonsillar area. And this is to make the Yonkers suction to suction the blood during the surgeries of the oral cavity, oropharynx, or the nasopharynx. So, quickly we revise all the instrument. This is Boyle's Davis mouth cap.
डेनिस ब्राउन टॉन्सिल होल्डिंग प्रोसेप मॉलिसंस टॉन्सिलर डायसेक्टर एंड द एंटीरियर प्लर रिट्रैक्टर ईब्स टॉन्सिलर स्नेयर स्ट्रेट एंड कर्व टॉन्सिलर अटरी प्रोसेप दिस द कर्व नीगस अटरी प्रोसेप दिस द कर्व सीजर टू कट द टॉन्सिलर टिश्यू दीज आर द टू बॉ प्रोसेप This is a non-tooth forcep, and this is a tooth forcep. This is a yonkel suction to suction the blood, and these two are the Draffel's bipod with Magron's plate. These are the all instruments of the tonsillectomy. Thank you.